All right, guys, it's that time again. The dawning has rolled around again. That's right. Uh, so we're also going to roll into uh, this video a weekly reset, a uh, little update, seeing what's going on. So, by the way, before we get into the video, if you're not if you're not subscribed, like subscribe, and also if you found this video helpful, drop a like. So, double nightfall rewards uh, is on this week. So, in the nightfall playlist, you, you're going to get double rewards. Pretty uh, pretty self-explanatory right there. Next up, celebrate the dawning. So. Uh, a dawn of uh, new rewards and a new exotic ship, a stasis powered sword. Interesting. We've got a stasis sword. And that's gonna be like, that's gonna be interesting. Uh, bring snowballs to a gunfight. Stasis infused snowballs. Pretty sure they had something similar to that last year. Um, and we got some new ornaments. Which I'm guessing are these right here, which I've seen some images online. They look badass. Especially the Warlock. The Warlock looks badass. So we'll get into those. We'll have a look at those. And that seems to be it. So. We have Speaks with Ava Levante, which we'll do soon. Um, Cosmodrone. It's the Devil's Lair. Yep. Boom. So we've got Devil's Lair as the Nightfall and slash Grandmasters. So I might actually accept, believe this or not, I've not done a Grandmaster yet. Because I'm not high enough power. Well, I am high enough power, but I've not attempted one. So I might attempt one this time because that is my favourite strike. Um, right. Start off. Because whenever I do these, I always forget the store. Always forget the store. So don't forget. 30th anniversary gift. Make sure you redeem that. That is weekly. You get 700 bright dust every week. Make sure you redeem that. Very important. So, events. We'll have a look at that. This is new stuff. So here we go. We got. Start with the warlock. So, bite with silver, or you can bite with bright dust. That looks beautiful. I, I love the look of that. that looks sick. That looks amazing. I like that. Um, this is Night Warlock. So you can buy all these with Bright Dust as well. I like the helmet on that. The helmet looks sick. What else we got? Um, got Northern Light one. So this is, I believe, from a previous year? Yeah, 2019. Uh, Winter Heart, 2017. Cross Reach 2018. Then we got a couple new emotes. Oh no, that's that's a finisher. <laughs> Gets yeared. He got yeared. Yeared. <laughs> uh, looks like we've got some new ornaments here actually as well. So we can quickly like flash through these. So it looks like there's actually gonna be a third decent amount yo. <laughs> hey, yo, that looks cool. That looks pretty sick. Pretty nice. Ice carving. Now, what I want to see is Icebreaker come back. Weird random thought right there. But I want to see Icebreaker return. Because I'm pretty sure on Destiny 1 they did some really cool looking, like, icy sort of uh, ornament for it, which is pretty cool. It's got a snowball fight. Got a snow globe. Got a snowman. It's in the trailer if you didn't see it. You can actually build a snowman. It's pretty cool. Got to get that breed. That was pretty sick. <laughs> okay, that's pretty sick. <laughs> I rate that. Uh, we got a card shuffle. I might have to get that one. <laughs> that's that's sick. Uh, we got some ghost shells. Oh, look at that. He's got little little muff, muffle, mufflers, ear mufflers, whatever, headset. I don't bloody know words. <laughs> uh, we got a gift wrap shell. That's like my uh, my wrapping style on Christmas. It's just uh, terrible. We got a little sweater. A little Christmas sweater. Got a little elf hat. Oh, you got Christmas lights. 
He's got the LGBT light. No, it's the RGB lights. If you've not seen that meme, where you been? <laughs> I like that. That looks sick. <laughs> that actually looks badass. I quite like that. Um, that's cool. Polo Express. Lol. <laughs> that's pretty sick. That's cool. Gift giver. Oh, he's got engrams in the back. That's sick. I need to purchase this immediately. Unless I can earn it. We will hold off. That's for that previous one. I think I've actually got that. Interesting. Looks like a snowplow. That's very shiny. <laughs> um, It looks like a bunch of previous... Yeah, it's all the previous stuff in it that they used to have. Previous seasons. Interesting. These are new. Bong. That's sick. Yeah, that was in last time. Uh, 30th anniversary. Nothing new been added in here. Dead quick. Nope. Uh, let's move on to the bright dust section. Oh, hang on. Featured. What have we got? Justified Cobalt. I'll probably pick that up. Uh, Piled High, so we can get the transmat effect. Ski Walk. <laughs> Alright, so we could get that as well. That's pretty cool. Uh, what else we got? Hold up. <laughs> Wait a minute. I went on the wrong thing. Uh, we have... Oh, that's there. So we can get that in Bright Dust. There we go. Cool. Uh, next up, we got Snowball Fights in there. So we can get that. Uh, graceful Spin. That's also in there. We get the Muffled Shell. Boom. Chill of Winter. That was a pretty default looking one. That's right. Uh, okay. And then we get the Frostborn Shell. Uh, the Shell? Ornament. Pretty cool. Tangled projection. Oh, it's a little like Christmas lights one. Nice. Then we've got a bunch of shaders down here. So we got Dawning Shaders. We got Resilient Laurel. Laurel? Laurel. That's pretty cool. Dawning Tranquility. Nice. And Dawning Celebration. I like that. That's nice and purple. Go with Void Build. Ice Ball Effects. Nice. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And then the Sweet Entrance again. Nice, so we've got some pretty cool things in the uh, in the store. Um, let's head over to the tower then. Speak to Ava Levante and see what quests we've got. Because I'm interested to see what sort of uh, weapons that they're adding. It'll be quite interesting. Because um, if they're adding... I've not seen anything about a new exotic. If there's adding a new exotic, I would be very happy. Icebreaker, please. <laughs> Can we have Icebreaker back, please? Might actually purchase some of these. Especially this one. I quite like the like, slight contrast between the two. I'll have a look. Ooh, it's all snowy. Look at that. Oh, that's nice. I, lo I love what they do with the events in the tower. It looks so sick. Is there footprints as well? Yeah. That's cool. All right, Ava Levante, what have you got for us? So we've got like a little book. Holiday gift baked. Oh, yeah, they get the little oven and stuff. So we get the elegant guard shell, which... Oh, that was pretty cool. Pretty sure that was in the uh, 30th anniversary. Moments of Triumph t-shirt code and Moments of Triumph uh, emblem. I, I, I want to try and get the t-shirt code. I want the t-shirt. Um, Alright, so... There we go. It came up. So, Dawn and Oven 2.1. Info recipes and ingredients. Eva's made some modifications to the Dawn and Oven this year. You can now find... 
all of the recipe information for each cookie in the recipe section in the oven of the oven even if you haven't yet baked that cookie description of uh, each ingredient now clearly communicates its source it was also taken the time to whip up whip up a couple new recipes for some returning faces interesting so let's have a look recipes so deliver these uh delicious treats to commanders of Allen tower boom <laughs> galadoodles yes So deliver these to Zavala. Then what we're going to get. Got a Donna Spirit. We've got a blue and gift return. So return to Ava Levante. Cool, 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 cool. So then we give her Tonic Spirits. There we go. There's all of the inventory for this little mini event. So we got uh, Bin Friends and Ship each day from Ava Levante, so we can get that with Dawning Spirit. Um, requires quest completion the Dawning, 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 Dawning. Okay, so it's probably buy that. Yep. Boom. So, unlock boons, exchange gifts, and more. This Dawning Guardians can trade up the Donning Spirit to Evil Avante in the tower for more for powerful limited time upgrades. Including these upgrades uh, is the Boon of Friendship, a daily gift that allows you to pass an assortment of uh, Dawning goodies to your fellow guardians whenever you complete a place activity. Once you completed the appropriate Dawning quests, you will unlock the ability to, to give a gift in return to Evil Avante in, in exchange for focus rewards. So for doing this quest, we get the Zephyr and Polycarbon Powder Shader. Complete the quest, the Lost Splicer on Europa. Uh, speak to one's Val in the Tower uh, from Ashes and Mali Biach <laughs> Bronze. And we also get a Boon of Friendship. Grants a dawning reward to your fighting upon completion of place activity rewards based on the player's boons active. Boom. So this is the new sword. Let's have a look. Zephyr. Okay. Power to sword. It's slow targets. Guardian. Uh, while receiving damage generates class ability. Energy. With impact. Nice. Interesting. So we can get little boxes. Which I'm guessing... Oh, here we go. Exchange a gift in return, guaranteed to contain either the fusion rifle or an avalanche machine gun, or you can get the Zephyr Fold or the Cold Front submachine gun. Cool. And we got a Vapor Will Spin. That word just completely looked like something else then. I had no idea what it meant. <laughs> and then we've got a bunch of quests to do. And also, oh, Gift of Dawning's Past. Boom, go to the second page. I've got myself some Alpine Dash, which is probably the slowest sparrow in the game at only 100 speed. I don't have enough legendary shards. The game. <laughs> um, right, we'll have a look through this anyway. That's a bit annoying, but okay, whatever. Um, oh, we got a mint visual effect. So then, Dawning Chair Upgrade. Fully upgrade the Dawning Chair Sparrow with festive perks. Some of these perks are only active during the Dawning. And then the same again. So let's have a look at that Sparrow then. So it's upgradable. So, Purchase Correspondent Upgrade. So, let's put a tuned NLS drive around the best possible performance. That probably up to the 160. Um, dodge better. Alright, so again. And then that allows us to uh, reload weapons and charge grenades while riding. Interesting. That's pretty cool. My little uh, upgradable sparrow for uh, people who played previously. Quite interesting. 
I never have any legendary marks. I always run out. Or legendary shards, even. But, um, yeah, cool. So, that's the, um, the update. I'm, I'll probably just play this um, a bit. And mess around with that. Uh, we've got nothing in here. That's fine. Cool. So, with that, hope you guys have enjoyed. Thanks for watching. If you did, make sure you drop a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you want to see more Destiny content, then make sure you hit that subscribe button. Drop a like, all that good stuff. And I shall see you guys later. Bye for now.